I go and talk to them. And I ask them, what are you doing? Why are you wearing that? What's up? You know, and I'll, you know, if I see other people on the streets, I'll talk to them. And generally, I, I think in Edgware, where, where we work, the, I'm, I'm, I'm a recognisable face and people accept me coming up and asking, you know, just having a chat with them. A lot of young people still find it a bit strange, you know, and I can understand that because, you know, of, of my job. But it's, uh, it, it's not something I'll go up and, and start giving them a hard time for it like perhaps other other people might it's something where i'm going to go and talk to them and try and point out do you realize that when you stand in the bus station and there's six or seven of you and you've all got your hoods up all those old people over there feel a bit threatened now is that right or is that wrong i don't know but you should know that if it's your grandmother you know you just need to know that the, the way you are and the, the clothes you wear can influence other people and how their fear of crime and, and things such as that and it's those sort of conversations that, that, that i tend to have and young people aren't prepared for those conversations with a policeman, you know, because all, all they think you're going to come over, give me a hard time, search me, throw me out the station, arrest me. But that's not, that's not what we're about. We're about educating.